The mother of a six-year-old boy who shot his teacher at an elementary school in Virginia just earlier this year pleaded guilty to child neglect earlier this morning. Yeah, Deja Taylor was charged with a felony and could serve six months in state prison. Her sentencing is scheduled for October. And MSNBC anchor Lindsay Reiser joins us live. And Lindsay, tell us what happened in court today. What type of possible sentence could she be facing? So she did plead guilty here to one felony count of child neglect. Now, as part of this deal with prosecutors, a judge could use discretion and sentence her up to five years. It's expected that prosecutors aren't going to ask for more than six months. So as part of this deal, uh, there was a misdemeanor count that was dropped, recklessly leaving a, a firearm loaded, endangering a child. That was dropped. But remember, she also pleaded guilty to a federal count in June, and that was using marijuana while possessing a firearm. She's also expected to be sentenced for that in October. That could be 18 to 24 months. Her attorney tells us today that those could be served concurrently. But you'll recall just last week, we got some new details in this case. Unsealed uh, affidavit, probable cause statement. A, a teacher who actually restrained this six-year-old child uh, told investigators that he said things like, I shot that be dead. I did it. I got my mom's gun last night. Taylor, according to this new information, told authorities she believed that the gun was in her purse on top of a dresser, had a trigger lock on it, but in a search Police did not find that trigger lock. I want to go ahead and listen to some of what her attorney said today about whether she finds herself, Taylor finds herself responsible for what happened. She feels very responsible, feels very bad. And I think that's part of just the general irritability, anxiety, depression, and everything else. He said they're also going to um, work on some of those issues, postpartum issues, talk about that at sentencing. There are just no winners here. This is a sad case all the way around. Have we heard from the teacher who was shot? Abigail Werner, she's suing the school district for $40 million. We haven't heard from her today yet in response to this guilty plea from Deja Taylor, but we did hear a statement from her last week when we got that those new really hard to listen to details. And she had the, the statement from an attorney that said Abby was an optimistic, dedicated and caring elementary school teacher who endured the unthinkable. The statement went on to say she is surrounded by the support of people who love and care for her. And we are thankful every day that she survived. And Lindsay, before we let you go, what is the school district saying about those allegations that administrators might have ignored multiple warnings here. The school district has said they're not going to comment on legal proceedings, but they did send out a statement. They said um, that, that they've worked cooperatively with authorities. They also say that we remain committed to ensuring the well-being and care of all students and staff. Meanwhile, that lawsuit continues on. All right. MSNBC's Lindsay Reiser for us there. Lindsay, thank you. Thanks so much. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.